Hey, what is up, guys? If you came in here and in this video today, guys, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to install Windows Blind 8 skins. And today I have a Windows 7 tutorial for you guys. You could also do this on Windows 8, but um, my Windows 8 uh, was kind of slow while I was trying to do this. So I'm going to be doing it on my Windows 7 here today. So without further ado, guys, let's get into the video. Now, the first thing you want to go ahead and do is go to this uh, website called... Um, windowscustoms.com or wincustoms.com and uh, you're going to want to go ahead and find the font you want or not font, um, theme that you want. So I'm going to be pitch, uh, doing this one right here called Ice Cave. Looks pretty cool. You don't see any previews but the name just sounds amazing. So now once you're here there's uh, just a simple download button. Just go ahead and download and it should open up like this and then just hit OK. Oh, well, this is probably a pretty big one, so let's go ahead and find another one real quick. Oh, okay, there we go. And then, okay. So let's just go ahead and cancel the ice cave one, because that's taking a little too long, so pause. And as you can see, this one downloaded already and right here as you can see in here hang on I'm gonna close that uh, you can see right there there's the folder this is the only folder you want to go ahead and extract do not um, extract like these uh, Microsoft Word um, documents and JP Im images just extract the actual theme so go to extract to and go to desktop and then okay And now that you're here, as you can see, uh, we have the um, the Alpha Nebula. Let's go ahead and put it right on his face. And then, now that you're here, uh, it will say in the corner right here, uh, ready to uh, use. But what you're going to do uh, at this step, you're going to go ahead and close your windows blinds. And now that you're here, uh, it's going to be on the desktop. Put it on his nose. And uh, click on it, and then right click, and then go to install the skin. And it'll take literally not even a second to install. So now it's already installed, as you can see down there. A skin called Alpha Nebulon has installed. And, uh, plus skin, yeah, blah, 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 all that great stuff. And now we're going to want to do right here, you're going to go to here. And then, uh, I have it in my hotbar already, so just, I don't know, if, if it's not in your hotbar, just type in Windows Blinds or something. I don't know, it should, it should automatically go into your hotbar, just... If it didn't go to your blog, go to your recent downloads from wherever you download it from. But mine's in my hotbar already, so I'm just going to go ahead and open that up. And now that you're here, you're going to go ahead and scroll down. And as you can see, uh, that's the Phobia one I just installed. Right there. And um, I believe it was called Phobia. I don't know. Oh, no, it's called Alpha Nebulon. This is the one that I had uh, installed before, but... Um, I didn't get a chance to install it, but this one I guess installed earlier than the other one. But, oh, here it is right here. Alpha Nebulon. And as you can see right there, this is the one that I literally just installed. And then now that you're here, going to go ahead and hit Apply Style. And it's going to say, please wait, all this great stuff. And it's going to load the theme up. Now you can see in the background, like look at your little logo down here. You can see all the stuff is going to start to change. So right here, as you can see, I have my theme style. This is pretty awesome. Wow. This is this is awesome. This is a pretty good theme. I recommend downloading this because this is just really cool. Like I like the like the doc style down here. You got a cool like little um search bar right here. Da -da -da. Yeah, I like this one. This is pretty cool. So I recommend getting uh the uh Alpha Nebulon. I'll leave a uh, link in the description for the one that I used in the video. So yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for this tutorial. That's all there really is to show. So yeah, guys. Anyway, um, hope you guys enjoyed the video, uh, thanks so much for watching, and yeah guys, I will see you guys later. Thanks so much for watching.